Stigma is the mark of shame and embarrassment connected to a personal trait, quality, or behavior, like drug use. We create stigma when we hold and promote negative views about people because of who they are, what they do, or their circumstances in life. Stigma can become structural, meaning it affects the way entire institutions or organizations treat people. When hospital workers ignore people who use drugs and fail to take their health concerns seriously, that's an example of structural stigma. Many people who use drugs experience stigma every day. Because consuming drugs like heroin and cocaine are illegal, people who use them are frequently criminalized. And this leads to being stigmatized twice. Once as a person who uses drugs, and a second time as a criminal. Stigma creates real barriers for people trying to access healthcare and vital social services. Because of the shame that stigma causes, people who use drugs often avoid asking for needed help or telling anyone about their substance use. This creates a harmful cycle where those who would benefit from help the most can't access it. And this further marginalizes them in society and compounds harms related to their drug use. People who feel ashamed are also more likely to use drugs alone. This means they are at greater risk of dying because no one can revive them with naloxone if they overdose. We can all work to eliminate stigma by how we act, using non-stigmatizing language, for example, or by being more inclusive and understanding of those who use drugs. Stigma is not just felt. It has real-world consequences for people's health and safety.